Hello, and welcome back to the channel. We appreciate you stopping by for this video. We just recently went to Disney, and of course, we videotaped us eating all the food at Disney World. So, we wanted to make this video. It's a short one, nice little quick one. Brief, if you will. These are some of the meals that we had, plant-based vegan meals. So, let's go right through these and check out what we ate. <laughs> so let's get into this video and see what we had. The hotel that we stayed at was Art of Animation, and the restaurant in Art of Animation is called Landscape of Flavors. The first thing we had was a Chipotle seitan scramble. This, uh, it was pretty good. Kate will also note that I think this was spicy. Was it spicy? I think I remember it being, nah, it wasn't that bad. The next meal we had was at Liberty Tree Tavern, and that's in Magic Kingdom. It was called, get ready for this, all you care to enjoy plant-based tavern keepers feast with the declaration salad when you get there make sure you say that you're vegan when you do that they will swap out the butter for plant-based butter and they swap out the dressing one without the honey and then the entire meal is plant-based the revolutionary impossible meatloaf with mushroom gravy and green beans was really good the dessert is called johnny Appleseed's warm apple cake that was exceptional you're going to be so full after this meal but save just a little bit of room to get that apple cake in there you will not regret it next up is center town market at the caribbean beach resort kate had the avocado toast which she really enjoys she wants me to note that the menu says that it's served with sriracha mayo but it's really not that spicy kate is not a fan of spice side note there brent and i had the plant-based island bounty platter i've had this a bunch of times and i love it it has just egg potatoes mickey waffle and a beyond sausage link it's hard to find the vegan version of this classic breakfast platter when you're on vacation or anywhere really and i think that disney did a really great job with this one and we highly recommend it our next stop was trotteria al forno and this is that boardwalk resort we all had the plant-based rigatoni bolognese. The flavor was very good and we all enjoyed it. Bonus tip, order the off-menu vegan garlic knots. Dude, it's been a while since having something like this and I would go back just for those. Next up, ABC Commissary. And this is in Hollywood Studios. It's called The Vegan Burger. The name is kind of boring and this video of it isn't that impressive, but the flavor of this burger is very good. It has sauteed peppers and onions and a balsamic glaze, sriracha mustard, vegan mayo ketchup on a vegan brioche bun. It hits the spot when you need a quick service meal. Kate would like to note that this one was spicy. Later that night, we stopped at Docking Bay 7 Food and Cargo, and this is in Black Spire Outpost in Hollywood Studios. We all ate the Felucian Kefta and Hummus Garden Spread. It had plant-based meatballs, herb hummus, tomato cucumber relish, and a warm pita bread. This was okay, but we really liked the meatloaf platter that they had the last time we were there. Last up was Pizza Fari at Animal Kingdom. We had the vegan pizza. Now make a note, you have to go to the window and order this. It is not on the mobile ordering app. We don't know why, but it's not. Also, apparently there's a vegan sausage that comes as a topping, but they were out of it when we were there. And of course, we had all the popcorn we can eat and maybe just a few frosty beverages as well. Hey, it was our vacation. There you have it. That's what we ate on our recent four day Disney trip. We're really big fans of Disney. We love going there. And it's very relieving that we can finally have something to eat at almost every single restaurant. So hats off to Disney and all the staff there for making plant-based and vegan foods more widely available for all of us. It really helps when we're going on vacation for real. In the comment section below, let us know what your favorite plant-based vegan meals at Disney World or Disneyland or any other park out there. Before you go, make sure to hit that like button. That's super important. It's totally free for you to hit. And if you're not already, please subscribe, hit the bell, all the good stuff, and we'll see you next time.